Can you go swimming in a wig? Well, let's find out. I'm here at this gorgeous Australian beach on a just acceptable beach day. It's not quite as hot as I would like it to be, to be considering going in the water, but look, you've been asking for this video for months and months and months. I remember when someone asked me to do a video about going in the water um, with a wig on and it was it was like a June winter Australian day and it was absolutely hideous and that was the last thing I could, I, that was the last thing I could want to be doing and I was like, as soon as it is warm enough, I will make that video. So here I am, I'm going to go on the beach, I'm wearing my game changer wig, um, I'm going to put it up in a little scrunchie, got my scrunchie here, I think that would probably be the best demonstration. I personally like won't be going in the like beach water or pool water this summer with my game changer wig on because I would probably wear my um, workout wig or an old wig or a spare wig or something like that. That's usually my advice for people um, when considering what, like how to go swimming in a wig. But um, since I get the question all the time, even yesterday on several consults got the question, can you wear the game changer wig in the water? That's the one I'm gonna wear. So. This poor baby will be getting a nice treatment later after we've done this because this is not normally what I would put my best wig through, but it's fine. Anything for you girls. So I've been slow, while I've been talking, I've been slowly wading out and we get, get, I'm up to my knees now, feeling a little chilly. Got my assistant here today, Lauren, this is my sister-in-law. She might hold the camera for me while I put my head underwater because can you imagine trying to put your head underwater and keeping your phone out? That's, I'm not going to try and do that. There's enough going on. I've got to concentrate on the wig. <laughs> I'm not going to also concentrate on the phone. So here we go. Okay, so I'm just going to pop my hair up in a ponytail. Um, it's very secure. I'm not worried about security. Hang on, my glasses will fall off. I'm not worried about it falling off in the water or anything like that. Oh, thanks, Lauren. Um, I just think that maybe for the hair um, and looking after the hair itself, I'll put it up in a ponytail. I don't know if that's going to be helpful, but I just feel like it is. So I'll put that up in a little scrunchie. Make that look a little bit cute. Okay, and then I'm going to go. I missed a bit. Classic me. I always miss a bit. I don't have a mirror. I'm using my shadow as a mirror uh, on the ground there. It's a lovely Australian day. How are you enjoying it, Lauren? So good. You're warm? I'm so warm. Okay. My legs have lost feeling. <laughs> Not from the warm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Do you want me to go on first? Yeah, obviously. <laughs> okay. I'm right, holding well, we're gonna up have to wait out a little bit more. So come on. Okay. Oh. It's not too bad now. It's not too bad. I'm gonna go all the way under because just this doesn't answer the question, does it? <laughs> Obviously, you can do this in a week. Okay, it's we're getting lower. We're getting there. Just fall backwards. Just oh, do it. Do you think? All at once. Just do it. Do you think? Yes. Is that what the people want? Yes. <laughs> oh, you only go underwater. It's so cold, and your lungs just go like no. <laughs> but at least it will be over and done with. Okay, ready? Yep. One, two, lost her! Oh, it's so cold! Oh, it's so cold. My lungs don't work. And I should have worn eyelashes. Wash an idiot. Sea water. Wow! Okay, very good. Oh, I've got that out of the way. Oh, Australia's lovely. I've been swimming out of beaches. It's so much fun. Okay, so we've got that. Look, I'm doing I'm fine. Wig's there, right? I fell backwards. Nothing happened. I'll go on to again forward for you. Anything for you. Okay. Still cold, but still not a problem. I can't believe I wore lashes. I can't like wipe my eyes to open them again. <laughs> like an idiot. Okay. How do we feel about this question? Has it been answered? <laughs> Okay, hair's fine. It's still not going anywhere. Like, it's not gonna come off. Like, I feel secure, feel comfortable. Does it look fine? Do I look like I'm wearing a wig? <laughs> you look great. <laughs> I bet I look great. All right, definitely you can go swimming in your wig. Maybe choose a warmer day. <laughs> I, still, I still can't talk properly. I'm so cold. But we're having fun. And my ears blocked. That's gonna be blocked for good. Okay, so. 
definitely can do whatever you want. Just look after your hair properly. When I get home, I'm going to wash this. I'm going to give it a treatment. I'm not going to just let the beach water sit in it for days. I don't think that would be great. If you're going in a pool with chlorine, definitely wash it as soon as you get home. Like wash it, treat it, condition it. Don't let that chlorine be in there for longer than it has to. Um, and yeah, you can definitely go swimming in a week. You can definitely go to the beach in a week. Yay. Yay. <laughs> Thank you to my assistant Lauren for filming me and um, composing herself quite well. Uh, I was just informed that there were parts that she was laughing so hard she may have like missed me, but that's fine. <laughs> that's the fine. Gist. Got the general gist. Whew. Okay, we're going to have a little dip. <laughs> I'm starting to... Um, acclimatize the water a little bit it is gorgeous so it is a lovely day so now that I'm here now that my hair's wet may as well enjoy it a little bit and we'll talk to you soon other tips for going in the water I guess for securing your piece you can always wear a wig grip if it's a wig a topper grip if it's a topper um, you know use the extra options you have i guess um if you if you're wearing a wig that has clips use the clips that day if you like use the comb that day even if you don't usually use them um, like the topper use all six clips if you don't usually use all six clips um, wear a headband if you like that can also help i guess secure it more take it off your mind like if you're not see i'm so confident in my wig and i've been swimming in wigs before and i know my game changer very well like i just had no doubt that that was not going to be a problem but if you're worried and you know you're just going to spend the whole beach day thinking about your hair then even though i know you're going to be fine just use those extra security options to give yourself that peace of mind so you can just relax and enjoy your day so definitely yeah extra security looking after your piece so treating it well afterwards making sure you give it a good wash and deep condition um and the only other thing to bear in mind i guess is that you know we're clearly in quiet harsh sun here in Australia so if you're in quite harsh sun all the time then one thing to know um, is that your hair is going to oxidize um, quicker so the color on your hair is going to fade a bit quicker but I mean for me personally that's just that's like that's just kind of the price I guess for enjoying your life if you're a beach babe if you hang out at the pool with your kids all the time like it's okay if you have to get your, your hair wig recolored a bit more often than someone who doesn't. Um, so just, just enjoy yourself, live your life, don't let your hair hold you back and just know that in a luster you'll be absolutely fine. <laughs>